último partido, ya se lo tengo que The World Cup is arguably one of the hardest trophies to win in sport. The World Cup is arguably one of the hardest trophies to win in sport. The chance only comes around once every four years, and once every four years, and the legendary Lionel Messi is running out of time. The World Cup only comes around once every four years. The World Cup is arguably one of the... Do you need me to kind of sit like this? Yeah. Would you like it out of the way so you can at least shoot something? Yeah, yeah. Tonight we're going to do it at Amazon. They read my grant piece, so they want to Cup is arguably one of the hardest trophies to win in sport. The chance only comes around once every four years, and for the legendary Lionel Messi, time is running out. That's fine. Every four years, and for the legendary Lionel Messi, time is running out. One more on that, and I'll do the next one. I just don't check this okay. yeah. The World Cup is running out of time. Step away until you're ready. But as Argentina put in one of their final training sessions before the semi-final, they must know that Croatia will be a tough nut to crack. 
Argentina lost to them in the group stage four years ago, and Croatia have won two penalties. Oh, Destin. Destin. Couple of luck, couple of luck is there. Yeah. They had to sort of seem to have Destin the best as well. Yeah. Yeah. They got to the 2015 final. Oh, okay. Yeah. They put in one of their final training sessions before the semi final. They must know that Croatia will be a tough nut to crack. They lost. But as Argentina put in one of their final training sessions before the semi final, they must know that. Really? In the group stage four years ago, and the 2018 finalists also seem to have destiny on their side. They've won two penalty shootouts to get this far. The lucky underdogs from Europe never quite seem to know when they're beaten. Back to you. The final, they must know that Croatia are a tough nut to crack. Argentina lost to them in the group stage four years ago and the 2018 finalists also seem to have destiny on their side too. They've won two penalty shootouts to get this far here in Qatar. Plucky underdogs from Europe never quite seem to know when they're beaten. Back to you. Te decía, lo dijo en la última frase de la conferencia de prensa post partido. Eh, le preguntaron por Messi, dijo Messi no me sorprende, es el mejor de todos los tiempos. Y, y yo 15 años que Messi es el 1 o el 2, el 1 o el 2, y la mayor parte del tiempo el 1, eh, por segunda vez en la Copa del Mundo va a jugar 7 partidos, ya fue finalista, hoy está en las semifinales. Ese es Messi, ¿no? El hombre que atravesó generaciones de futbolistas y siempre siendo el uno de todo el mundo. Por eso creo que es el mejor de España. de Qatar está en vivo ahora mismo el, el entrenamiento de Argentina. Eh, voy a voltear mi cámara para que puedan ver un poco, nos quedan tres minutos. Siempre la pista nos deja nada más ver 15 minutos de la práctica. Bueno, pues eh, estamos de eh, Quizá con la duda ¿no? de, de a quién poner el, en el lugar de, de huevo a cuña y de mentir, que sabemos que no van a jugar eh, en la semana de mañana por la acumulación de la pista. Ya sabes, son muy tontos, pero 
los que fallaron en el partido. Ahora entra de Paul, sale inmediatamente, ya está Guido Rodríguez ahí eh, en el centro, peleando por el centro de la zona, pero es más y es, es poco, ¿no? Les podemos ver que sea táctica o alguna, alguna jugada de estrategia. ¿no? ¿Perdona? Es una buena pregunta. Thank you.